Hello everyone, this is Wajid Hakim and welcome to my channel, Wajid Hakim Official. Today in this recording, we are going to talk about UAE Pass, the importance of UAE Pass and how to create an account on UAE Pass. Basically, UAE Pass is a single digital identity to all the government websites that you can access if you are already registered with the UA pass. So today in this recording, I'll be talking about the importance of UA pass, how to create an account on UA pass and which websites we can log in or we can have an access using this UA pass. Before we get started, if you are a new on my channel, Please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Press the bell icon so that you can get the latest updates on the time. Whether you are a tourist or you are a resident of United Arab Emirates, in both scenarios, you can create an account on UAE Pass. Today, I'll be talking about if you are a resident, so how you can create your account on UAE Pass. To create an account on UAE Pass, you should have a valid Amber's ID and a registered mobile number under your Amber's ID and a working and verified and registered email address. You can create your UAE Pass account by visiting UAE Pass official website or you can download the application. If you are using Android mobile, you can download it from Google Play Store or if you are using an iPhone, you can download it from App Store. Once the application is open, you can see the languages, Arabic or English. You can select any one is per your convenience. Once the language is selected, it will bring you to a new interface where you can see two options. Create new account and existing user. Existing user, it means you have already an account. Now you need to click on a create new account. So once you click on create new account, you will go through a new interface overview. You will see the terms and conditions. In the bottom, you will put the mark and you will accept. To proceed it further once you accept the terms and conditions it will bring you to a new interface where you can proceed as a citizen or resident or a visitor proceed as a citizen or resident then it will ask you to scan your Empress ID so you need to scan your Empress ID front and back side once it's done it will ask you to verify your details is per your Empress ID so if there is anything missing you can modify once all the details is per your Empress IDs are confirmed you need to confirm after that you need to provide your registered mobile number starting with 971 and rest of the number so you can verify with the OTP once your mobile number is verified then the second step is to provide your registered email so you can also verify the OTP that you received on your given email address. In this process, first you will verify your mobile number. Once it's verified, then you need to verify your email address. Once your mobile number and email address is verified, it will ask you to create four digits pin so that anytime if you want to access your UA pass, you can use that four digits pin to access your account. Once the pin is generated, you will see a new interface where it will say basic account registered. Then it will ask you to verify now. So in this process, you need to verify your facial verification that is also known as facial biometric verification then you will click continue and once the verification is done then you will see a new interface 
and it will say congratulations after you see this congratulations message then you will see a new interface it will ask you set my signing password then you need to create password then once it's successfully done it will say account is ready and your account will be open in the mobile congratulations now you have successfully created your uae pass account now you can have an access to all the government websites using uae pass thank you so much for watching this video i'll be providing you all the links in the description bar and don't forget to subscribe my channel like and share if you want to see such more informative videos don't forget to write in the comment box. Thank you so much.